So, Joel, what are your thoughts on last night's finale? Uh, it was a crazy finale. It was definitely not the uh, final two that I wanted personally, but at the same time, I think uh, out of the two of them, the better people won out of the final two between the brothers and Kelsey. There was no question in my mind I was voting for Kelsey to win the game. That ties into the next one, kind of why exactly did you want to vote for the brothers to win the game? I think the underlying factor why I swung towards the brothers opposed to Kelsey was number one, she was evicted in week four and I thought she kind of got back on a bit of a break, whereas the brothers, uh, I feel like they made a lot of bad decisions and stumbled their way to the end in the same way that Kelsey did, but they were more individual in their games, which I respected, whereas Kelsey, I thought, was always playing as a team and not playing strategically for herself to try to win the game. Yeah. So when you cast your vote last night, you mentioned that the brothers might be the luckiest winners. Can you explain what you meant by that? I just feel like they didn't really necessarily get to this point on their own accord. I thought they got a, luck, a lot of lucky breaks thrown their way where there were other people that stood out more and I don't think that besides winning some competitions, I don't really think they did a lot strategically and socially in the game that got them to this point. And, but Kelsey didn't either so it was more a question of like for me who was worse at those components of the game and Kelsey to me was a little bit worse at, that, at those components. And had Tim made it to the final two, would you have voted for him over both Kelsey and the brothers? 100% I would have voted for Tim. Tim is somebody who came in here, adjusted brilliantly to the Canadian version of the game, and like me, knew that he couldn't solely rely on competition wins, and he's somebody who blended in socially and who made a lot of beautiful strategic moves in the game, and everybody was wrapped around his finger, and I give him accolades for that as a Big Brother super fan. He deserved it. And do you think the rest of the jury had the same opinion of Tim? I think the rest of the jury, with the exception of uh, two people, would have voted for Tim. If it was Tim and Kelsey, Tim wouldn't have gotten all the votes. If it was Tim and the brothers, I think he would have 100% gotten all of the votes on the jury. Uh, there were some people who were playing it and seeing this as a game the entire time. There were some people who were seeing this as just sort of a friendship type of thing and wanting to give people their votes that way. That wasn't the way I saw the game. So looking back on things now, do you wish that you maybe didn't try and ride the middle as long as you did? Sorry? Looking back at things now, do you wish that maybe you didn't ride that middle as long as you did? Um, I actually, I'm torn between that because I feel like when I was at Final Five, I was in a really good position uh, between both sides. And sometimes a part of me says I should have just gone with uh, gone with the three show alliance because they were the ones that I knew I was higher up in the priority list that I could make it to the final two on that side of things. But at the same time, I think I could have probably made it at least to finale had I just gone to sleep and just let everybody go at each other. But I felt like if I was in a final three situation with Kelsey and the brothers, I would have had to win that competition in order to get myself to final two. But uh, yeah. Yeah, it's... And you'd said previously that if you got to the end, you believed that you could beat anyone at the end. Why do you think they would have deserved to win the game? I think I deserved to win the game because I didn't ruffle any feathers throughout the entire game. I'd formed a very strong social bond with everybody, and I felt like despite the fact that I didn't have a lot of competition wins on my resume, I felt like I had done enough strategically and socially to get myself to where I was, because I was always in the middle throughout the entire game, but I could point to specific moves in the game where I did put myself out there and try to make some bold moves and they just were, weren't as big maybe as somebody else who was in power in HOH but I was the first one to make a big move when I was head of household putting up the big three and I felt like I had enough of a resume socially and strategically to win. Yeah. And so as a fan of Big Brother, what was it like for you getting to share your experience with two past international house guests? Well you know what, I actually didn't know who Tim or uh, Nikki were going into the house. The only one that I knew who was a potential candidate was Jace and I was actually kind of grateful that it wasn't Jace because I knew his game and who he sort of buddied up with when he had played in season five and in All Stars. So I was grateful it wasn't him even though I knew him. But uh, it was it helped it was really helpful to have people who had at least been in the experience. Not the same game, but at the same time people who uh, knew what it was like to just suffer through the circumstances we were in that we're just these little lab 
rats in this experiment kind of thing. And uh, it was nice to have somebody there who knew what we were going through to talk to whenever we had down moments or whenever we were just really, really bored. And finally, do you have any final thoughts on your game or the experience as a whole, what it meant to you? Uh, it definitely meant a lot to hear the amount of accolades that I've gotten from past house guests about my game. It really, really meant a lot. So it's kind of a double-edged sword right now. I feel really strong about the game that I played. I knew this was the game that would potentially get me to the end to win the game. At the same time, I know that like if one or two things would have swung my way, I definitely could have won the game, no question, going into the end. So as a super fan, I really felt like once it was about final seven, final six, that I was in such a good spot that I legitimately felt like I was going to go all the way to the end and win the game. So it's a disappointment in that sense, but at the same time, it's, you have to take it with a grain of salt and I'm proud of the way that I played and it's really overwhelming the amount of support I've gotten already. Awesome. Thank you. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you.